Hey everyone, it's Marty. I'm back with a quick Ross TG Maxx haul. I'm just gonna go over, I got three things beauty related. I grabbed this wet and dry painless detangling brush. A just have a really travel size wet brush and I needed something a little bigger. So I grabbed this pattern that has the whales. They had flamingos and little Boston Terriers, I think. Then I grabbed this concealer from Becca. It's in the shade Cream. Hopefully, they had two shades. This was the last. Hopefully, this one will work. And this was $3.99. This was $6.99. So, it's just this Becca concealer. And then I got this Batiste Dry Shampoo Light and Breezy Fresh Scent. This was $4.99. I got this. I don't wash my hair. Like, I get up at 4.30 in the morning to go to work, so I don't have... Like, I don't want to get up early and wash my hair. So, I do it on my days off. So, I go, like, a, I do a four-day stretch. So, my hair starts to get a little e. So, I figured I'd get this for in between. I've tried dry shampoo before, and I didn't like it. It felt like it made my hair worse. But everybody raves about this, so I figured I'd give it a try. And then, the other TJ Maxx stuff was I grabbed this Clifford's First Easter. I hauled Clifford's First Christmas. This was $4.99. And I'll put this in his little Easter basket. And the only other thing from TJ Maxx was these little slip-on shoes it's by Little Me. They were $6.99. They're just so cute. I probably won't save those for Easter. And then the rest is Ross. I grabbed two books from there. This was $3.99. There's this little bunny book. I grabbed this just in case I couldn't find anything at TJ Maxx. Just, and it was cute anyway, even if the little arms and stuff move. So this was $3.99. I'll probably still put that in his Easter basket. And I grabbed this Me and My Dog for $3.99. I just thought it was so cute. It's about a little girl, but it's still cute. It has cute little pictures. And I grabbed this bubble turtle for the bath. He needs some bath toys. This was $4.99. That book was $3.99. Oh, I can not said that. It's just a little turtle that you blow up and it rattles. I thought he would enjoy that. And then I showed him this little phone. We were going through the toys. I was kind of just showing him stuff. It's $4.99. He loves our phones. Loves them. And this is just shaped like an iPhone, smartphone. It's $4.99. It says 12 months plus. I don't know. He seemed to do it. I don't know if he'll be able to push the buttons. But I might save this for his Easter basket. He's still not going to be 12 months at Easter. But whatever. I haven't decided yet. And then I just grabbed some more spoons. They were $2.99. I got spoons at the Dollar Tree I hauled. I'm not really a fan of them. They're, they're fine. But they stuff doesn't really scoop out very well. It's hard to explain. But I do have this brand. So I figured six spoons, $2.99. And then I grabbed two bottles. He's needing, he just uses basic bottles. He doesn't need anything fancy. I needed ones that were more than eight ounces because he's pushing, like he does eight ounces now. But I figured we could use some later. I should have grabbed the other set. It was $2.99. It just has little bears. Um, and then the last two things are little two pieces of clothing. I've been looking for a little Easter outfit. Like I want a little dressier church, like a dressier outfit to take pictures and go to church. But I saw this. It just says my very first Easter. I might save this for his Easter basket. I don't know. But they just had one of these that I saw. It just has little bunnies on it. And it was $1.99. And it's just one you made by Carter. And then I also just saw this little sleeper. I think there was only one of these left. And it's just one you by Carter's. And it was $3.99. But it has this really soft bunny in this blue color and the little butt. And little bunny feet. So I don't know that I'll save that for Easter. Because he needs some sleepers. And I don't know, he might not have it by then. So, that was my little Ross TJ Maxx haul. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to follow along. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Hey everybody, it's Marty. I'm back with a quick little haul. I figured I would slap it on to the end of the... I did a little collective haul from Ross and TJ Maxx, and I just got my order in from Carter's. I didn't order. I ordered four things, so I figured I would just throw it on the end of that one because... That other little video is only four minutes, so I figured I would just add 
so first off, so this is from Carter's. Everything was, I spent $42, I think, on all this stuff. I got him some socks, just plain white. We have different colors, and we have the, like, winter-type socks, the fuzzy warm socks. So some days are a little warmer, and some days I just want plain white socks. So, and I didn't really have any. I have a cream, plain cream sock, but, and these are just, you know, cotton. And this is 12 to 24, and I got the tall socks for now. Come closer to summer or spring, I'll get, you know, lower cut ones, but that's it for now. These were originally 22. I want to say they were seven something. Sorry if you hear noise in the background. <laughs> yeah, that's the baby. So I have one bib, um, silicone bib that I use at home, but it's not very travel friendly. Like it's not one of those, like I've tried rolling it up, but it doesn't stay. It's not one of those that you can roll up and stick in. So I want to get another one for the babysitter or on the go or whatever. And this is the Skip Hop Fold and Go Silicone Bib. And this one you can actually roll up and it does stay, hopefully. And I want to say this was six months or six months. I want to say this was seven something. I don't know. I can't remember. I know Elvis was 42 and I got free shipping because I think it's over $40. You get free shipping. And then the next two little things are clothing. I want to try, oh, wow, that's long. Um, I have him some, I don't know if I ever showed these in a haul. I need a 12 month sleepers and they are hard to come by, not the fleece, cause he does not do well with fleece. He broke out in a rash with fleece and he's just a hot baby, like hot baby. Um, so I wanted to get cotton ones, but I found these ones on T or Target and they're, you know, lightweight and stuff, but they are like, the sleeves are really tight. They're hard to get on. Um, but they're really nice. I like the patterns and stuff. It was a pack of six, I think. It does have the grips, but, and also it has the thing where it cinches on the foot. But the sleeves are just really skinny. And it's not, he's fat or anything, but they are hard to get on. I mean, I still use them. And I still will, but I got those a while back because he's just out of the nine month sleepers. So I saw these, I was gonna get several, but I just wanted to get one to try it out. It's the Carter's 12 month. And this was originally $20, I don't know. I don't think this had a price on it. Yeah, I don't know, that bad. But I thought I'd give these a try. I finally found some other ones that were fleece, that weren't fleece. These are ribbed. I don't know if you can kind of tell that. They had really pretty colors and I was gonna get some more. I'll have to get on there and see if they still have them. But I wanted to get one to see what it was gonna be like. It has a cute little pocket. They had really nice neutral colors and they're just a zip up. I don't know if they're, I don't think they're gonna be, and these ones have the zipper that can go up, but I don't think these ones do. That would probably be the only downfall to that. But these actually might work. And they do have the grips on the bottom and kind of the cinching, but not as, they don't, well, these arms look pretty small too. So I don't know, I might not get more if they're just like that, but. Yeah, they're hard to come by. The footed sleepers bigger than nine months that aren't fleece. Like, fleece are everywhere, which I get it's winter, but he just does not do well with fleece. Mm -hmm. Then lastly, I just got this little outfit. I was kind of trying to find stuff to, so I wouldn't have to pay shipping. So I got these little pants. They're going to be way too big. I'm getting everything 12 months because the outfits, he can fit nine months. Now, if it's a one-piece outfit, he has to have 12. The nines are just, they're high-rise. I, whatever they're called <laughs> but so like 12 month outfits I could still do nine month at least in some like the pants are going to be too big for now but it'll be nice to have a pair of pants they're just gray and they're, they're like sweatpants but they're not um real heavy so he could wear these in the you know March April but the shirt he could probably wear now and yeah he definitely could wear this just has little whales on it I guess it has little collar button up, short sleeved. This set was $22, but it wasn't. I know the sleeper was $10, so it was half off. But I just thought this was cute. I hate, I don't like Raglan style shirts. I know they're kind of cute. I hate them on me, and so I haven't really bought any for him just because I don't really like that style. And the onesies, the onesies that um, kind of like this, where they have this piece, this wasn't a very good one to show, but. They have this piece that folds. Those annoy me. So I've been trying to find ones that didn't ha don't have that, which I think it'll get easier when you get bigger sizes because they're not like 
a lot of 12 month sizes are t-shirts you know they're not actual onesies but anyway thank you for listening to my ramble and watch my short little haul but it'll be tacked on to the other one like i said so yeah if you'd like to follow on on my channel just hit that subscribe button like comment all that fun stuff sorry about the noise in the background the baby's got a new toy and he's figuring it out anyway and i will see you next time